Hey what is up everyone, so Samsung recently updated their health monitor application which is kinda essential to monitor the blood pressure and ECG on the Galaxy Watch 3 and the Watch Active 2. As usual with this new update, the previous version has stopped working and whenever I open a Samsung health monitor app, I get this notification at the bottom saying that Samsung health monitor needs to be updated to the latest version which is 0.191. And if you tap OK, it will take you to the Galaxy Store to download this update as we have a modded application without any country restriction. So we cannot update this app here in the Galaxy Store. But once again, the updated Samsung Health Monitor Mod APK is available to download thanks to Dante from XDA for the file. You can click the link down in the description and download this file absolutely free. After downloading, you don't have to uninstall the previous application or Samsung Health Monitor and you can simply install this new .191 APK that you have downloaded from the website. After the installation has completed, you can just use the app normally and there will be no data loss along with no requirement for entry of information all over again. So it's a simple way to keep the Samsung Health Monitor app updated on your Galaxy phone. And most importantly, the app has no country restriction so you can use it anywhere in the world. Also if you are thinking about the health monitor application on the Galaxy Watch 3 or the Watch Active 2, it will be normally updated with firmware updates from Samsung. So you don't have to worry about anything on the watch. I will keep updating you guys regarding any new update that comes for the Samsung health monitor app. And in this way without any data loss, you can continue to use blood pressure and ECG on your Galaxy Watch 3 and the Watch Active 2. Also, if your watch is still without ECG and blood pressure, you can follow the simple steps in the video which is linked below. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comment section below and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, bye bye.